Welcome boardwalkers to my studio. I'm CB Mac and on this channel you'll find tutorials about plein air painting with watercolor, gouache, ink, graphite, and colored pencils. I also do some art supply reviews. Today I thought I would uh, swatch my core mini urban sketch set of watercolors. So let's get started. In this set, there's a swatch card, which I will probably use and swatch later. A protective cover paper for the palette. And then these six lovely watercolor uh, half pans. And it has six empty ones that you could add your own other colors in it. Um, the six colors that we have are Benzamazal, Benzadazalone, Yellow, Quinacridin Red, Cobalt Blue, Cobalt Teal, Van Dyke Brown, and Payne's Gray. I'm going to just wet these up real quick with a drop or two of water on each one. I like to use this little dropper bottle that I can fill up with water. It makes it a lot easier and I don't get water all over my palette in the crevices and everything by spraying it down. And I'm going to use our painter's color diary. My... Um, six by eight inch one and we'll just get started here use this bright yellow I like this bright yellow oh that's nice and as you can see that just jumps across the page on its own Core watercolors are, tend to move quickly across the page just by the way they're made. My quinacridone red, I apparently got this in different order here. I don't know how I managed that. Alright, this one I didn't put down the water first. So it's not moving across that block like that yellow one did. Let's see how it moves. Ooh, yep, see how it moves? I just barely touched that. My goodness. All right, then we've got cobalt blue. Somehow I got my cobalt blue and my quinacridone red swapped in my card here. That's vibrant. I like that vibrant blue. I love how vibrant these colors are. These will really be fun to play with. All right, let me pre wet this teal square. See what this teal will do. Ooh, I like that. That will be nice for my seascape paintings and for some skies paintings. Van Dyke Brown. Get a little more pigment on my 
brush here. Come on. And then last is Payne's Gray. Let's see how that moves across the page. Let's wet, pre wet this square so we can see how that moves across the page and see if it has any extra blues or if it leans toward the other direction. Ooh, pretty. Pretty, pretty. That is going to lean toward the blue. Dark blue. Yep, a blue-gray. That'll be nice for shadows. Dark, stormy skies. Mm. And if you see this little travel palette, you can see that it has these lovely little wells to mix your paints up in. It's also got mixing space here in the palette itself. Um, these are interchangeable. You can pop these out. Although I can't get one out right now for some reason. But they they are your standard half pans so you can interchange these with other half pans or put new colors from core or anything else in these other six pans let me see if i can get this up closer where you can see it And that is your core mini urban sketch set of artist quality watercolors. If you're enjoying this channel, could I ask you to please tap on the like button, share this video, and click on the bell icon for notifications of my upcoming videos. It makes a huge difference in the growth and support of my channel. Please feel free to ask a question below or post a comment. I do try to read each and every comment, although I'm not able to always reply to each and every one. Um, and in this video or in the video description, I will put links containing um, affiliate links to be able to get this set of core mini watercolors. Um, it just means that I'm awarded a small commission for purchases made through them at no additional cost to you. And again, thank you for your support to my channel. Um, please check out my favorite artist supply list also on Amazon. I will put a link in there for that. And I appreciate you spending some time with me today to swatch out this uh, six half pan set of core mini urban sketch watercolor palette. Look forward to seeing you again next week. Goodbye.